You ready? You ready? All right, Coach, opening statement, please. Okay. Uh, well, we knew it was going to be a tough game. Uh, they, they, uh, they got to a good start there. 14 zip, and uh, we knew they weren't quick. They showed that last week against Alcorn. I've uh, been down at halftime, and come back and I play Alcorn in the second half. So we knew that uh, we got to play 60 minutes, and then lo and behold, they tied up the game. We was able to go and uh, get two more scores after that. And uh, in the second half, we uh, we got a couple more touchdowns. But, you know, it, it was a tough ball game. Uh, they, their program is taking the right direction. They played hard four quarters, and uh, we were just able to make a couple more plays, and they couldn't make like, Getting a quick start, <clears throat> I hadn't thought of you all since you started conference play that, that much, but getting a quick start is basically what you, your plan as far as what you need to do to get in this. Uh, that, would, that would be great yeah, if we could get a quick start 14 zip every game. We didn't do that last week. We got behind 16 zip and was able to uh, keep fighting and the guys stay together and we was able to come back and win the football game and have to take a block punt. Um, uh, but against Southern, we got up on um, Southern. We was up 21 to 6 one time on Southern and wasn't able to hold on. So, um, you know, that's always the case. It, it's great if you can get off to a fast start. That's telling you that you're doing a good job in your film study and what you think they're going to do and how you're going to attack them if you can get off to a good start. And then you got to, um, then you have to be able to make adjustments when they make adjustments. So they start making adjustments and slow us down there for a second. And then um, we have to make some more adjustments and, and start back scoring. So um, it's always good when you score early. Because I mean, you study film and uh, you had a good game plan. Talk about your your player, your quarterback. He seemed to, whenever he needed to go downfield, um, extend out, he was able to do that. Yeah, he, he's playing great. You know, he's keeping us in, uh, in uh, every football game, giving us a chance to win. And uh, he understands what we're trying to do, where we're going to go, uh, depending on the coverage. And uh, on the RPOs, you know, he's, he's making good reads on RPOs when to give it and when to pull it and throw it. Uh, he's playing the position of quarterback at a high level for us, and uh, like you say, when, when we need him, pick him down the field, he can get it down the field. If not, he take what they give him. So he's doing a great job of uh, just taking what defense gives him. Uh, speaking of your quarterback, uh, you think the running game can help uh, open up everything for him? You guys have 228 touchdowns total compared to 164 or 1 for TSU. How much do you credit the running game? Open up the offense for you guys tonight. Oh, whenever you can stay balanced, it, it makes it hard on the defense to uh, pinpoint in the gears back and rush you. Then we had 27 carries, 226 yards rushing, and 36 um, pass attempts for 215 yards passing. So that's pretty balanced right there. And as uh, long as you can stay balanced, uh, it makes it tough on the defense. Once you become one dimensional, they can make you one dimensional. It's pretty tough to uh, move the ball and get first downs and score points. Now, this is my offensive coordinator, Dwayne Taylor. This is my defense coordinator, Mark. Bassiani. So if you have any questions for those guys, they're here for you. As well, Defense tonight, Coach. Were you happy with what you got? Uh, even though you won the game, you know, just talk about the Me and him. the coordinate. Uh, we got we got to play better than we did tonight. We had too many self-inflicted. Uh, uh, possessions that got going. We had too many penalties, uh, too many pass interference, uh, roughing the passer. Those were three, three uh, third down big plays. We had a big play on, in first in, uh, first half. It was first and 25. And we got a pass interference. And gave him gave him the ball down there in the red zone. So we got to really really hone in on that and not you know not uh, self implode and uh, really. Really play hard. We we're playing hard. We just got to play a little smarter than what we did tonight, as far as the penalties goes. Uh, got two takeaways. We really need to uh, get a couple more of those, uh, and we got to really got to got to be better on third down. You know, they were, they were uh, six for thirteen. You know, that that's way too high for where we need to be. Coach, I didn't get an introduction on the gentleman to you. Coach Taylor, Delaney Taylor, offense coordinator. All right, Coach, I mentioned earlier about the quarterback. You running back, you see when he got around the edge, he was able to get out of his, what is it, about his speed or something you all saw? This well, um, this is a film study. Uh, we knew they were going to try to stop our passing game. Uh, um, Trayvon Walters came out today and uh, get right out to the offensive line, blocked hard. Uh, defense kept it in short fields. Walters had a touchdown around 55 or 53 yards. Um, we got some big holes to run through. We're getting off on the linebackers. 
Uh, we made some checks. The quarterback made some checks at the line of scrimmage. Like Coach Man said, he's playing quarterback. We knew if they gave a certain front, we wanted to run certain plays. Quarterbacks made the checks, and uh, the guys just played hard most of the time. One more question. All right, that's all. I appreciate it. Thank all right, you. thank you. No problem. Thank you.